Hi everyone, my name is Iman. This is the Iman Global YouTube channel. Welcome back to another AI tutorial. Please support my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get started. Iman Global YouTube channel. Imagine being able to turn anything in your mind into an artistic image just by typing a few simple words. No experience, no complicated software. That's exactly what Paclumen does, free AI tool that uses text-to-image technology to create visually stunning pictures in a variety of styles, like realistic, anime, line art, or even 3D animation with a Pixar-like feel. Every image you see in this video has been created using nothing but Paclumen. In this step-by-step -step guide, I'll help you bring your own ideas to life through beautiful visuals. Paclumen might just be the beginning of a whole new creative journey for you. To begin, make sure you're already signed into one of your Google accounts in your browser, since you'll need that later to create a Paclumen account. I search for the Paclumen website in a search engine like Google. Usually, the first result is the official Paclumen site. On the homepage, I click on the Launch App button, which is located in the top right corner. On the next screen, there are several login options, using a personal email, an Apple account, or a Google account. I choose Google for convenience and select one of the accounts already logged in on my browser. Once logged in, I'm taken straight to the community page. This is basically Paclumen's public gallery, where images generated by users are displayed. At the top of the gallery, you'll see several tabs, or in other words, categories that help you easily browse and filter the images. Clicking on any image lets you see it in a larger size. Below the image, the main prompt that generated it is shown exactly the phrase that was used to create that visual. If you click the Remix button, it opens a new workspace for creating an image. In this mode, all the details from the original image, including the prompt, negative prompt, image dimensions, style, AI model, and more, are automatically filled into a new form. You can use these settings to generate a new image that's based on the original, but with slight differences in the final result. This feature is great when you want to create multiple creative versions of an image without having to write a new prompt each time. Clicking on your username, located at the bottom left of the screen, takes you to your personal profile and settings. Paclumen's user interface supports multiple languages. To change the language, simply click on the English option at the top of the page. A drop-down menu opens, and you can choose from languages like Spanish, Italian, Portuguese, or French. Right here, by clicking on Settings, you enter the Account Settings section. You can view your account information here, and if necessary, even delete your account completely. From the menu on the left, I go to the Rewards section. By logging in daily, you get a free amount of Lumen added to your account. To claim your daily reward, I click the Claim button, and 10 Lumens are added to my account. In addition to this, by doing things like liking images, leaving comments, or following Paclumen on social media, you can earn more Lumen the more Lumen you have, the more images you can generate with this AI. To create my first image, I go to the Create section from the left-hand menu. At the top of the page, there's a text box where you enter your prompt. A prompt is basically your idea in text form. Paclumen reads that and tries to create an image based on it. The more accurate and detailed your description is, the better the AI understands your concept and the closer the result will be to the vision in your head. So I recommend writing your thoughts carefully and with detail, to get more professional results. I already have a prompt prepared, and I paste it into the text box with a right click. In the top right corner of this box, there's an option called Prompt Helper. When I click on it, a set of visual style options appears. Styles like Neon, Fantasy, Van Gogh, Comics, Sci-Fi, 3D Animation, Graffiti, and many more are all tabbed and ready to explore, with an impressive variety. After picking the style I want, it's time to select the AI model. This option is right next to the prompt box. At this stage, several models are available for image creation. We'll go over them in more detail later. But for this example, I choose the Paclumen Art V1 model. Next to the model selection is a drop-down menu for setting the aspect ratio. Here, you can decide if your image should be square or rectangular, either vertical or horizontal. This helps tailor your output to platforms like Instagram, TikTok, or YouTube. Since I create content for YouTube, I select the 16 to 9 format, 
which is ideal for horizontal videos. In the following step, you can set how many images you want to generate at once, anywhere from 1 to 4. Since I'm currently on the free plan, I choose 2. After finishing the setup, I click the generate button. The request enters the queue, and within a few seconds, the result is ready. Two thumbnails appear. When I hover over each thumbnail with the mouse pointer, a trash icon appears on the left to delete the image, and a download button on the right for downloading it for free. To view more details, I click on one of the thumbnails to see the image in full size, then I download it. The result is truly stunning, a perfect match for my idea of a beautiful young woman with colored eyes. The Art V1 model in Pikluman has performed flawlessly, generating a gorgeous, professional-level image in just seconds. Using the panel on the left, I can access all the images I've created so far and review them. I check and download the second image as well. Then I return to the reward section from the left menu. For generating my first images, a bonus credit has been given to me, which I claim by clicking the claim button. After that, I go back to the create section again. This time, let's create the second image in a completely different and eye-catching style, 3D Pixar style. I paste the prompt I prepared earlier into the text box with a right click. In the top right corner, I click on Prompt Helper, and from the list of available styles, I select 3D animation so the final image will have a cartoonish, three-dimensional vibe. Without changing any other settings, I hit the Generate button again. After a few moments, the image processing finishes and two new thumbnails appear. To view the details, I click on one of the images to see it at full size, and then download this beautiful 3D visual. The result is genuinely impressive, a 3D image in Pixar's visual style, full of vivid colors, soft details, and the atmosphere of a scene straight out of a professional animation. You might not believe it, but with this AI, we can even create logos. I paste the prompt I had already prepared into the text box with a right click. Without changing any of the other settings, I click on the Generate button. After a few moments, the image processing is complete and two thumbnails appear. I click on one of the images to view it in a larger size, then download the logo and get ready to use it in my projects. This circular 3D logo with a human brain and neon lights has a professional and unique design, perfect for the digital branding of the Amman Global Channel. You can use this method to design your own custom logo, too. This AI image generator can also be used in the advertising design process. I paste another pre-written prompt into the text box with a right click. Using the same previous settings, I click the generate button again. A few seconds later, two thumbnails appear. I click on one of them to see the larger version and download this ad image. This lively and energetic image of an Iman Global can shows how AI can help you create eye-catching and exciting promotional posters, so go ahead Give it a try in your own marketing efforts. Now it's time to explore some of the other image generation models in Pikluman's AI. I paste the next pre-written prompt into the text box with a right click. Next, I select the AI model, which is located in the upper right corner, directly next to the prompt box. For this example, I choose the Pikluman Realistic V2 model from the list. I click on the Generate button, and after a short wait, two thumbnails appear. I click on one of them to see it in full size and then download the image. This black and white portrait, with its incredible detail in the wrinkles and deep gaze, is a breathtaking masterpiece created using the power of the Pikluman Realistic V2 model. Shall we move on to the next image generation model in the Pikluman Art Generator? I paste another prompt I've prepared into the text box with a right click. In the top right corner, right beside the prompt box, I open the model selection list. For this example, I choose the Pikluman Anime V2 model. I click on the Generate button, and after a few seconds, the image processing is complete and two thumbnails appear. I click on one to view it larger and download the image. This anime-style illustration, with its vibrant colors, fantasy elements, and magical atmosphere, is a striking demonstration of the power of Pikluman Anime V2. Pikluman AI also has the ability to generate images in the line art style. This style involves simple line drawings without shading, often used to create minimal and elegant visuals. For this, I use a prompt I've already written and pasted into the text box. 
In this example, we'll generate an image of a Lamborghini in the mountains using the line art style. I open the model selection dropdown and choose the new Paclumen line art V2 model. Then I click on generate. My request enters the queue, and after a few seconds, two image thumbnails appear. I review the images and download one of them. As you can see, Paclumen AI performed impressively in generating this visual too. The line art style is truly unique and stylish, and I'm honestly blown away by the result. Let's now generate a cyberpunk style image using the Flux Schnell model and Paclumen AI. For this, I paste the prompt I had prepared earlier into the text box with a right click. Flux is one of the most amazing technologies in the world of AI image generation. This masterpiece was developed and released by the team at Black Forest Labs. The exciting part is that through Paclumen's art generator, you get access to the free version of Flux Schnell. From the model selection dropdown, I choose the Flux Schnell model. Keeping the same settings, I click on the generate button. My request enters the queue. In a short time, the text to image process is completed using the Flux Schnell model, and the thumbnails are displayed. I browse through the results, and as you can see, it has generated some incredibly stunning visuals. This blue cyberpunk supercar, glowing with neon lights and packed with detail, feels like a flame cutting through a rainy city night, a true masterpiece from the Flux Schnell model. The AI image generation models in Paclumen, such as Realistic V2, Lineart V2, Anime V2, and Flux Schnell, each bring their own unique strengths to the table. They give you the power to transform any idea into a professional and distinctive visual creation. Mastering these tools means you'll be able to produce creative, eye-catching images in any style or genre, dramatically enhancing the impact of your projects. Now it's time to smash that like button and share this video with your friends. This is just the beginning, you're going to be amazed in the next tutorial. So hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell right now, so you don't miss a single one. Remember, artificial intelligence is the future, and the future is something you need to embrace today.